I'm Brigham Larson with Brigham Larson Pianos. We just finished this 140 or so year old Weber piano. We're going to be delivering it here soon. And oh baby, it turned out awesome. Wait till you hear it. But I want to show, show it off first. Okay, this, I, I'm pretty sure this is rosewood, um, which, which is super illegal now because it was just so over harvested in the late 19th century. And, uh, and so there, the, the stores of, of uh, rosewood are still struggling to come back. But we still, we still have rosewood pianos. So uh, yeah, beautiful refinishing job. We've got all of these beautiful uh, hinges and hardware, the pedals down there, this little keyhole thing, scutcheon. That looks nice. This and that, this little knob thing here. Got new keys on there. You know it's you know it's a good key job when all of these notches, when you can look down right here and all of the notches just line up in perfect, perfect row, and everything is just totally 90 degrees, everything's totally flush, looking gorgeous. But it's the inside that is my favorite. So let's check that out. Not bad for 140 years old. Check that out. We've got new hammers, new dampers, new strings new tuning pins, new felt, refinished the pin block and we've torqued all of these tuning pins. They, they need to be 100, 100 to 120 pounds of torque on each tuning pin. We've got new hammer butts. You can see a good, well, good hammer job when you can put a uh, straight edge across here, right there, right here and the top here and then this swoops up right here that's part of the part of the design of that and then and then we've also got uh, the back checks or, or, or sorry the the uh, hammer butts the catchers on the hammer butts that are also in a perfect perfect straight line none are none are higher or lower than the others these are original but, uh, but they've been polished extensively. Oh, and this is, this is kind of an interesting, interesting thing that happened to this piano. This bolt here, this is actually not original. When we, when we first put um, tension on this piano after it was restrung, the pin block, which is that thick, it's about an inch and a half thick, the pin block in this area it started to bow out. So it was, it was, hmm. Let's see if I have any, that, well, so the pin block is right about here. It runs all the way along and it's glued and bolted to, to these back posts, to, to this, to this back support and these huge ship beams. It's, everything's glued together, but, but when we put, put it under tension, that pin block bowed like it was a piece of spaghetti. An inch and a half piece of maple bowing like spaghetti is, that's a lot of tension. So we took the tension off, glued everything back, clamped it, and, and now we put, we put this bolt in there. This is exactly where the bowing was. It was in between these two bolts, right there. And the, this bolt, goes here come come bring the camera back here goes back here it goes all the way through the piano so so that ain't going nowhere that's kind of an interesting interesting repair we, we've done that a number of times over the years that's that's not a super uncommon it's it's uncommon but not not unheard of by any means okay more beauteousness under there let's check this out Ooh, look at
look at that plate. That is a lovely plate. That looks amazing. Soundboard looks gorgeous. You can see little repairs. Well, don't look too close. If you don't look too close, you won't see them. There's almost they're almost invisible. The repairs on the on the soundboard. This bridge here, that's new. This bridge cap, you can see the seam right here where the root of the old bridge ends right there at the seam. But that's all, you know, sanded smooth and lacquered and then the new bridge cap begins. So all of that we make a pattern of exactly what the what the bridge pins are and duplicate that pattern. Put that back on. Oh, that looks nice. Okay, now let's play it. hear what a 140 year old piano s can sound like. This is piano is so old it doesn't even have 88 keys. The highest note is this A. So it's missing an octave up from those three. Applause, applause. That is, that is an awesome piano. This piano hasn't, I wonder if it sounded that good in the 1880s. I doubt it. No way. Yeah, not a chance. <laughs> that piano sounds not great.